I'm Desiree Linden, in Uten, Kenya, getting ready for the Boston Marathon 2014. Excited to be headed back there uh, 2011. It's a runner-up performance. It was pretty much a highlight in my career. Um, came back on the polar opposite end after making an Olympic team, which was awesome as well. Uh, went to the Olympics and had a pretty big injury heading into the game, so that was a major disappointment. Went to Boston. 2013 was looking to get on the line there and kind of rebound from it and I uh, had to pull out from that same injury so it's been a long journey to get here um, to be training well to be training somewhere new on uh, getting ready for the 2014 race in Boston. So why Kenya? Um, I think why not Kenya? People go to altitude all the time and it's in the states and it's easy and it's in your comfort zone. Um, this just seems a little bit outside the box, different in the time of my career where I'm looking for that, uh, kind of just trying to refine my excitement for it and get fired up about these big races. One of the great things about being a professional runner and having the support of a company like Brooks is that I can be a full-time runner so I can go anywhere in the world. Um, so there's no reason I should just stay at home with my head down and my blinders on and just keep clicking off miles uh, when I can go somewhere that's warm and new and you know sort of pick your head up, look around and maybe find out something that you, you just never knew before. So the majority of my runs have been done with Lanny Marchant, the Canadian record holder. 228 woman uh, who basically has held my hand this whole time and like kind of showed me the ropes. This is her third trip out here, so she knows all the stuff or she pretends like it, we get into trouble and then I'm like, oh, you have no idea what you're doing? Thanks. <laughs> it 10 Kenya is situated, I I believe 7,800 feet and it's right above or looks overlooks the Rift Valley here in Africa. So I'm staying at HATC, uh, Lorna Kipagat's High Altitude Training Center. It's kind of this one stop shop where your food's there, you got a gym, the sauna, um, there's a, a nice pool, like everything's there. It's all geared towards runners so that you feel comfortable there and it's got pretty much everything I need. I think coming here to attend is kind of like that leap of I'm all in to just sort of exhaust all my options and uh, really know that I did all the things that I could to get myself ready for race day. Um, you know, I want to go the line and be like, well, it was cold in Michigan or you know, I was hurt last year. A Boston special, you want to go there, you want to perform well, and I'm doing all the things that I can to, to make that happen.